So if you visit a business, you have a bad experience, it's natural to want to sound off about it. You want to warn your friends and family, maybe post some reviews for strangers to see. Yeah, but we think it can be just as important, if not more meaningful, to recognize those businesses that are getting it right. Yes, a guest believes that too, right here from the Greater Omaha Chamber, Melissa Glenn. Good to Hi. see you. Hi. Nice Thank to have you for having me. Good Thank to you. see you. Good so to be here. why do you think that these businesses should be celebrated? You know, we live in a really special place, and there are a lot of people that pour their heart and soul into the businesses, and that's what really makes this community special, and that's obviously something that we want to celebrate. So this is a perfect way to do it. How are you doing it? What do you have up your sleeve here at the Chamber? <laughs> Great question. We've got the Greater Omaha Business Excellence Awards. Uh, it's an annual award, and uh, everything is done to celebrate what's happening here in Omaha. So. Uh, the nominations are open until February 13th, mm -hmm. um, and really what we're looking for is your story. So uh, what is it that took to award. get to where you are? Mm -hmm. yeah. Who's eligible? Are these businesses that are chamber members, or is it any business? How does this work? Great question. Yeah, chamber members are eligible, um, but it's any chamber member in the greater Omaha area. So uh, Council Bluffs, any of our surrounding communities, everyone's eligible. Mm -hmm. Who do you want to? Who do you want to hear about? Are there specific stories that this the judging panel uh, <laughs> is looking for? Yeah, really, we're looking for a really great story. So what that comes down to is what's important to each individual business owner. So maybe it was a situation where they believe strongly in what they do. Maybe it's a family business. Maybe they had uh, some trials or tribulations that they had to overcome to get mm -hmm. here, or maybe they are just really, really great at right. what they do. Just a good company. Excellent every day. Uh, there's lots of ways to define excellence, but I guess mm -hmm. under the excellence umbrella here with these yeah, awards yeah there are different categories so there what are. are the categories yeah there are additional recognitions so we're looking for innovators leaders uh, people who are contributing to the community through uh, philanthropy nonprofits mm -hmm. um, and then people who are celebrating milestones and all of the details for all of those awards are on the website you said February 13th is the deadline is the deadline yes so you've, you've got a little bit of time but I think yes. that's something to where you intend to do it but then you know, you forget about it, life takes yeah. over. So maybe do it now. Do it now. Um, yeah, well, yeah, if you've got a, the time today to do it. Um, here's the website. So what do you recommend? Take us through the step-by-step -step sure. for how our viewers can sure. get involved. Absolutely. Uh, what we really recommend is write out your questions, uh, write out the answers to all of the questions, and mm -hmm. make sure that it feels like um, something that reflects you or your business. Uh, so again, something that really draws out that story. Uh, we're not looking for, um, you know, specific A, B, C, D, uh, but we're looking for what brings out the emotion of why you're in mm. business. So. Mm -hmm. so a thoughtful response exactly. is yeah. what yep. you're looking for there. Yeah, it's different exactly. for different industries it as well, is. so that's why it's good to yep. put that on paper. Yep. But uh, again, the winners are going to be announced when? Uh, the end of February, but they're going to be celebrated May 12th at a big party mm -hmm. open to the that's public. That's my anniversary. Yes. Oh, Not oh. That, you can yeah, celebrate at the party. anything to do with anything. <laughs> well, <laughs> Happy 8th anniversary, Mary and Troy. <laughs> Do you want to recognize a couple of partners? And obviously, this is the chamber, but yes. you've got a couple of great folks helping you out. Absolutely, um, Smith Hayes has been a great partner. Um, Markle First Comp, and um, you know we we we're just happy to have everyone here helping us. So, um, oh, thank you to all of the uh, chamber staff too who've. Uh, you been working on this all there. year long. I yeah. feel like the last few years, maybe I'm just paying more attention now, <laughs> but it just, it feels like the energy has has amplified Absolutely. quite a bit at the chamber. It's How exciting. How many people we have down there at the chamber now? Oh gosh, over 50, 50, I think 54 now. Jeez. 54? Yeah. Hot dog. No wonder. Have yeah. um, <laughs> you added staff? Is that why we're hearing about you guys? Natural okay. energy. We were talking Absolutely. about Pasquale yes. and the sauce. Yes. How do you yes. pronounce it, Melissa? It's Worcestershire. 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 That sounds about right. Yeah. I think I've heard my yeah. mom say it like that. I think that's the Western right. Nebraska yeah. dialect. Yeah. Uh, all right. So the reason she's here isn't just to talk about Worcestershire, Worcestershire, Worcestershire <laughs> <laughs> sauce. It's to talk about these excellence awards. So if you want to nominate a business, please do it by February 13th. Uh, the Chamber's on Twitter and Facebook, so you can keep in touch there. But really, the main reason we wanted Melissa to join us today on the Morning Blend was to spread the word about a job well done. And you can also learn more by calling, by logging on to omahachamber.org. Um, but this is really open, not just to businesses. We think about this, um, but you know, my eyes have opened to this too. It's not just those businesses that were within the city limits. Mm -hmm. There are chamber businesses that really all go into Sarpy County and all over. Absolutely. So explain this when we talk about an Omaha chamber 
business, yes. where can you be? What can you do? Any place in the in the region. So Harrison and Pottawatomie counties uh, in Iowa, um, you know, any of the surrounding counties, uh, you know, surrounding Douglas mm -hmm. here. So do you just look for the logo? I mean, is that the best way to know if <laughs> yeah. you're if you're a consumer, if you're a regular Absolutely. Joe or Jane mm -hmm. going in? Just look for the seal on the door. Absolutely, look for that chamber seal. You can check it out on our website. We've got a business directory. Give us a call anytime. We're happy to help. So yeah, and you know, I own a small business. We joined the chamber recently. It's great to network with all these. And welcome. Yeah, thank you. But it's great to network. <laughs> I'll pat him on the back for you since <laughs> thank he can't you. reach it. It's great to network with all it these is. other businesses in the area as well. Yeah. It is. And as a local show, right, we come in contact with a we, lot of chamber members, mm -hmm. but we love local and we love excellence. There's so, I so like much going works. on here. Yeah. Absolutely. It's a great thing to celebrate. And I think with especially Omaha, the more you give, the more you get. So mm. the more you get involved, the more you talk to people, the more you're going to get out of the experience. And so. recognize it. Right. People Absolutely. don't do a good job because they want praise. Yep. But it's nice to have it. Yeah. It, it is, is nice to have it. it. And this is what it does. Melissa, thanks for coming in today. Thank you so much. And thanks. enjoy, Happy enjoy to be 53 here. and sunny. <laughs> you will. <laughs> Truly. Next, a special way to honor your pets. Through paint, Cherie and Emmy are in the house. Yeah, then at 942, Rachel Price and the little Nebraska town that inspired her viral hit. You'll hear it live.